Uh, hello? Uh, yes, is Miss DeWitt there, please? I beg your pardon? Miss DeWitt, is she there? This is she. Hi, this is Mark and Brian from KLOS Radio. We're calling you. Uh, sorry if, if we woke you. We didn't mean to, to intrude. We just wanted to put you on the air and let our listeners hear you and ask a few questions. We hear that you used to do Wilma. Oh, my goodness. You did wake me up. <laughs> well, can we call back some other time? Is there a more convenient time? Uh, well, I tell you, it would uh, it would be better. I could do the voices better and everything. Oh, well, we, we, we know you could do the voice. We just wanted to kind of talk to you. Uh, sure. Can we put you on the air to say hi? Well, sure, if you would like to. Are you live? Uh, yes, ma'am, we are. Right now, you're on the air now. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, no, we, we had a guy call up. We've been doing uh, Flintstone trivia most of the day, and he called up and he said that he knew your number and how neat that would be to hear from you and see what things how things are going for you. Oh, well, as you can see, I'm very tired these days. <laughs> yeah, I can understand. Again, we'd be glad to call you back some other time if it's no, more convenient. No, that's okay. Okay. Now, you were the original Wilma? Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. And uh, why is it that you no longer do it? Just uh, decided to retire, go do something oh, else? No, I do it. <laughs> You're still doing it now? I do it whenever there's anything to do for Wilma. Oh. Excellent. Oh. We thought they had replaced your something. Oh, no, no, my goodness, no. I'm the last remaining original Flintstone, and that's where somebody might have gotten the idea uh, because they keep saying original Flintstone. Mm -hmm. Well, Gene, you know, we do a we do a few cartoon voices ourselves. In fact, we have a Barney Rubble, if you'd like to. Oh, by all means, let's hear it, because they're, they're looking for a good Barney. Okay, well, be prepared to feel all of Barney here, Wilson. This is my partner there, Gene. He's about to do his Barney Rubble imitation. I think you're okay. going to dig it. Here we go. Hey, Fred. Uh, that guy that screwed up, Wilma. Let me try this for you one more time. <clears throat> hey, Fred. What do you think, uh, Gene? Well, that's a little bit brief. <laughs> well, now, we also... It was a little bit brief. Well, Gene, we, we also have, uh, equally brief, we have uh, my partner, Brian, his impersonation of Fred Flintstone's laugh. Yeah. You ready for this, Gene? Okay. Pretty damn good. All right. So all I got is the laugh, though. <laughs> well, no, I can do hee-hee-hee-ha-ha. <laughs> but, um, okay, this is Fred's laugh. That sounds more like a jackass. <laughs> Can't thank you enough for that, Gene. We'd like to try to oh, figure really? out exactly what you're saying. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. We don't want to read between the lines. Stop sugarcoating your words. Just, just tell me exactly come on out with it. what you think of the invitation, if, if, if you could. If you could, just be kind enough to share that with us. <laughs> it sounds like Wilma's laughing, doesn't it? <laughs> you got it, doesn't it? Well, now, earlier when you said the name Barney, Barney, uh -huh. it sounded just like Wilma when you said that. Did it? Okay, anyway, Fred Flintstone's laugh. Here we go. Yee, 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 yee. <laughs> yeah, okay. Listen to that laugh. Just like Wilma talking to the big Will. Gene, we realize that you just woke up, but is there any chance that you could uh, clear it out there and maybe give us a, a <laughs> clear good, it out? A good bit of Wilma there. Well, let's see if I can put it up there. Hang on a minute. Let me sit up here and see what I can do. What the hell are you sitting on there, Wilma? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you? You're, we're suppo you're supposed to be here. You're not supposed to be out bowling. We're supposed to be on KMOS this morning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Hey, Fred. Yeah, the whole scene. <laughs> done right here. Oh, that was great. It is super, and we're big, big fans of the Flintstones, Gene. You should know that. And we've admired your work for years. Thank you. Thank you. Very, very kind of you to talk with us. Well, I, I appreciate your calling, really. Thank you. Can we give you, um, I don't know, can we give you concert tickets or videos or something? Well, just tell, tell me more about yourself is what I'd like to know. Well, we, we can come over if you'd like. <laughs> Pop by and hang out if you'd like us to. Make us some breakfast and we can talk. Gene, something you might enjoy and you might not have, we have a limited uh, situation with Flintstones videos. It's the first three episodes that we'd like to give to you if you'd like to have it. Oh, I'd love that. Okay, it's the very first three episodes that you ever did. Oh, that would be such fun to have. I'd love it. Are, Are you doing other voices now other than just Wilma, or have you always done just Wilma? Oh, my goodness, no. Uh... Wilma and the, the the baby pebbles I did. Oh, do some pebbles. Uh huh. Can you do pebbles for us? Well, that was kind of hard this yeah, early this morning. Hold yeah. out because she goes so high. You want to hear me do uh, Bam Bam? Okay, okay here's of course. Here's Bam Bam. Yeah. 
I do it, and then you're going to do that. <laughs> well, you're that comedy gangster, Gene. Yeah. That's what you are. If I can get up that high, this is really... Mm. Don't don't hurt yourself. Stand on your hemi peen. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Gene, we dig you. Yeah, we really do. You have become a buddy to the show now. There's one other thing. You haven't talked about the Jetsons. I do a whole bunch of voices on the characters. On the well, now, we have the first three Jetsons videos. Do you really? Well, now, I might not be in those. Depends on the characters. What uh, Jetsons voices do you do? You do, uh, you do the, the, the electronic maid, Rosie. Rosie, the robot maid. Uh, Mrs. Spacely, the boss's wife. Um, Miss Galaxy, the boss's secretary. Wow. And uh, Jane Jetson's mother-in-law. Boy, you're just a I mean, busy mother, woman. Uh, the mother-in-law of George Jetson. You are busy, busy. Well, I wish I was, but you know, we're not doing anything on him right now. Well, that's why these videos will come in so handy. Uh, yes, I said, well, let's see what... <laughs> Gene, we can't thank you enough for going on the Air Force. We'll probably be calling another day to bug you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. And <laughs> thank, thank, you. thank you for going on the air with us. And did you want to hear Fred's laugh it, 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 one more time before oh, we go? of course. Here we of go. course. I can't live without it. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> Well, I can't do the voice. <laughs> well, can't do it. All right, Gene, listen, thanks again. We appreciate you talking to us. You betcha. See you soon. Thank you.